off duty, I'm cool, you want to hang with me, clearly I'm fun. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here with me. This week's style video is all about the blazer. I'm going to show you guys modern ways to wear blazers and kind of edgy things to do with them. Let's get right into it. Okay, I have taken a blazer from Zara. This is in stores right now. If you like it, I'll put the link below. Okay, so I've taken this very dressy blazer. I put a hoodie underneath so you can see the hoodie. I really love this look. I think it's really kind of off duty, like you're trying, but you're not really trying that hard. And I paired it with some joggers and some white sneakers, just on the go sneakers. This is like, I have stuff to do, get out of my way. I'm gonna look good, but I'm not gonna really try that hard. Really cool vibe, your fanny pack, and just sling it over. We have a hoodie, we have the blazer underneath. It's just a graphic tee. Really, really easy. Layers are the key to the outfit. The more you kind of do with it, accessories, layers of clothes, it becomes more interesting. It grounds the outfit. Very, very modern. Switched it up a little bit and I added a black booty. Sometimes people don't feel comfortable in sneakers. They don't want to wear sneakers. They want the height of a booty. They like a boot. I like a boot too. This is very cool. A little bit dressier. This would be great for a Saturday afternoon. All I did was change the pant and the shoe. So now this outfit is kind of dressy. You could probably get away with wearing this to work on a Friday or one of your days where it's a little bit more casual. So you have the blazer. It keeps it dressy. You put a dress pan on, a belt, really grounds the outfit, and you've added a pump. Pumps are super, super professional. In a professional setting, they are the most professional shoe, and so it really makes this outfit business casual. And it's fun. It's like, yes, I'm not that serious. Yes, I'm stylish. The hoodie, it's like, you wear a hoodie under a blazer, and people are like, hang on, wait, what? Is that part of the jacket? Is it layered under the jacket? It's really unexpected, and that's what's so fun about this. I went to a fashion event. There were designers in our city showcasing the runway show. It was super fun, and I wanted to go. I wanted to look stylish. I wanted to look put together, but I didn't want to look like I tried so, so hard. These are leather pants. You can get leather pants everywhere. Right now, people are talking about Spanx leather pants. They're not real leather, they're faux leather. A lot of my clients are super excited about them, so I will link them below, but they're like a leather, so they lift up your bottom, they pull everything in, and apparently they're life-changing. So you don't have to have real leather pants. These are super old. So leather pants, a tall booty, okay? Remember, if your pant is really long, you wanna wear your pant tucked into your boot. No longer are we wearing pants outside of the boot where we lift the pant up and put it on top of the boot, no. Unless your pant is a wide leg movement pant, like whether it's a denim, a silk, a long movement pant, you want your boot to be over your pant. You want your pant to be tucked in. So that's a style tip. All right, so leather pants, a leather top, doesn't have to be real leather, it's just long sleeve, okay? And then a blazer. This looks styled, it looks dressy, it's appropriate. This would be a great date night outfit. Maybe your shirt has a little bit of cleavage for date night. This is a great girls night out outfit. It's an option, okay? So it's different, it's not skinny jeans. It's a little bit more elevated. If the blazer was black, yes, it would be beautiful. Yes, it would be very strong. But giving a pop of color keeps it really playful. And a long dangly earring is really trendy. It's really sexy. It's very evening. So it, all these components, all leather, you know, cohesive, a pop of color, a long earring, a little clutch, you know, a very cool booty. It's not really about the pants and the shirt. It's all about the accessories. This jacket has, you know, really unusual buttons. The buttons are almost like jewelry. So if this is a little bit too dressy, maybe it's not really you. You're more of a funkier girl. You're more of a urban girl. I totally get that and I can appreciate that. I love these fanny packs. I feel like they carry an outfit so much. 
I just, I'm obsessed with the look. I'm obsessed with the vibe. So now it's like, I'm cool girl. <laughs> I'm urban. <laughs> so I love this vibe and it changes the look, okay? If you didn't want to wear leather pants and you don't have an event, you could put a boyfriend jean. Let's do that. Everyone, I changed my pants. I put on boyfriend jeans and I took the long dangly evening earring off, okay? Crossbody, leather shirt, blazer, boyfriend jeans, and white sneakers. This is a great off-duty outfit. This look would work with any blazer. It can be black, it can be textured, tweed. Let's put a loafer with this if you're not a sneaker girl. All right, everyone, I added a loafer, okay? Do you see how the vibe changed? The sneaker made it really urban, young, youthful. This keeps it a little bit preppy, okay? So it, it just by changing your shoe can change the vibe of the outfit. A blazer and the way you carry it, the way it looks, the way it's styled is affected by your accessories. Number one piece of advice. We put a pump on and we can automatically see now it's a little dressy. Pumps are really powerful like that. I'm dressing someone, the very first thing I get them is pumps if they have a professional job. These little details, moving accessories around, changing the shoe, changes the vibe of the blazer. All right, everyone, here's another vibe. I wanted to show you a black leather jacket under a blazer. We all have a black leather jacket. We all have blazers. Again, it's about layering it. It's about putting on the layers to create the outfit, and it's not just the jeans and the shirt. Never is an outfit one shirt and a pair of pants, no. We have a basic leather jacket. We have our blazer, our key item, boyfriend jeans, and now it's cold out. Now it's raining, now it's nasty, we're in the fall, so we can't wear our nice white sneakers, they're gonna get ruined. We can't wear our loafers because it's too cold, and we don't wanna wear our pumps because it's off duty. Moto boots are the key. These boots I've had for, I don't know, maybe 10 years. Get yourself a decent all leather pair and you will wear them for life. The more trash they are, the better they look. If this isn't the coolest, chicest outfit, I don't really know what is. See, I rolled them here because if I didn't, it's gonna look like this. I'm gonna show you why it won't. I mean, to me, in my aesthetic, it doesn't work. The boot and the jean come together. I don't like this. To me, aesthetically, it doesn't work. So that's why I just took it and folded it up. If you were a 90s baby, you did this in high school. <laughs> and all my girlfriends know it. Okay, so you just pull it up. It, yeah, this is maybe a little high now that I'm looking on camera. Pull it down a tiny bit. Okay. Off duty, I'm cool. You wanna hang with me. Clearly I'm fun. <laughs> Take your phone and take a picture of your outfit. A lot of times in our mind's eye, we think it looks one way. Take a picture with your phone and then look at the picture on your phone and you'll really visually see how it looks. And you'll be surprised how different things look um, in a picture than maybe how you see it in your mind's eye. It's actually fascinating. Another way to wear a blazer, the double blazer. Okay, so you have your red blazer underneath and then you're slinging it on your shoulders like this. This is very like model off duty. You, you'll see a lot of high fashion people do this. And you can see it looks better actually done up because now the jacket looks like a shirt. Okay, and then this is the outer blazer. Okay, this is definitely high style. This is definitely fashion forward. If you're not into the black pants, put some skinny jeans on. That would be really, really casual and really cool girl. Jumpsuits are fun, they're easy. One piece and you're done. You can have them in cotton, you can have them in denim, you know, anything you like. Put a blazer over it, it automatically looks dressy. You wanna keep it casual with the sneakers, but you wanna add a layer to it. So I love to put blazers over jumpsuits. This is really casual. You know, you can see the print up here. I love that it shows that it's one piece. It's really easy. Of course, we can use our crossbody, you know. 
and keep it really easy. This is like, I'm going shopping, get out of my way type of outfit. We could do it crossbody, we know that. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you saw something you haven't seen before, which I know you will because I did my research. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please hit the notification bell. It'll let you know that I have a new video up. It'll notify you and you won't miss any of my videos. Please consider subscribing. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. As I keep telling you guys, the ball is rolling. I'm not slowing down. And hang on one thing, Brutus! There's Brutus, I know a lot of you love him and wanted to see him, and it wouldn't be a video if he didn't make a cameo. Thank you for watching, I really appreciate it. I'll see you again soon, bye.